And welcome back to Let's Play the Seventh Saga. I am Baller Scuba, joined as always by Necro and his trusty companion Valsu. We are still in the town of Biltham, and as you can see, Legis has ditched us because I can no longer fight him because he is not here anymore. So I kind of ran out of stuff to do here. Everybody kind of wakes up a little bit, realizes, hey, it was a dream. That is not the person I wanted to talk to. This must be her! Yes, the fortune teller looking lady. A dreadful circumstance! Oh no! We must alleviate this dreadful circumstance. We can go into the shops here. I believe just the item shop has anything worth interest at all. The, ar the armor shop, weapon shop, pretty much stuff that we've seen before, so I'm not that interested in it. But the item shop has potion threes, as well as magic waters and harps. Fortunately, I am full on those. Got those off screen. So I will meet you back in our next destination. Be right back. And I'm back, and here we are in the town of Brush. And... I have a little extra money, so I want to splurge on the fortune teller. I want my future foretold. Is the 2012 thing real? No. But I want to give him a hundred gil anyways. So let's... Great. I'm sure I can handle it. Whatever, crazy lady. I'm getting that rune. I'm pretty sure that's why they call it the Seven Saga. But how are we gonna get to the West Continent? Brantu, you finally done with your thing? Is it a transporter? Hooray! Automatic walking for the win. Everybody's marching line. Great job. Usually it's just called an airplane or an airship. A mecha glider, though! Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. So, here we are! In our little glider. That's mechanical. It's, it's, it's mecha and it glides. This is all done by the computer, by the way. I'm not controlling this, trust me. If I was, I'd take a lot straighter route here. And this is going to take forever. Oh my god. So, what have you guys been up to? Yeah? That's cool. Are we there yet? I'll be honest, if you're here just to find out what happens in this game, which is kind of unlikely considering that you've been listening to me talk about it for 31 parts now, this is part 32 I believe, you might want to fast forward this to probably about 3 minutes later, because I will not fast forward it for you guys. If I have to suffer through it, you must suffer through it. This is crazy music. Alright, so I don't know exactly how far we are in the game. I have not finished it yet. I'm still kind of going for the blind LP sort of thing here. And oh my gosh, we've reached the other continent. So, I don't know how much longer there are there, there is to the game. I assume that I'll be probably doing about 50 parts based on how long I've seen other LPs go. So, you know, I'm, I'm getting there. I, I don't know who the main villain is. I do know about Gorsha because... What the hell was that? We're going down! Whoa! I'm practicing my comedy. What the hell? Dude! Like, wait, 
Did Branching not come with us? He just like trusted us to fly it over? Oh, completely ruined. That sucks. Wait, where's my human sign? Y you will have to do where I can see that. Thank you, Captain Obvious. What? Come on. I, I was gliding. I was mecha gliding. Leave me alone. It wasn't really my idea, lady. Ugh. I am determined to find a human sign. There you are. Where am I, young lady? Valenka. Okay. Fair enough. What's up, pink hat dude? Okay. Armor shop, weapon shop. Let's go here first. The nothing shop. What do you guys have for sale? Nothing. That's awesome. You used to have many what? You used to have many Vistors. Um, it's global warming, kinda, but like, just localized in your particular area. Don't worry, Al Gore will be over to explain it soon enough. Soon enough. Do you have any sweet kick-ass armor? Uh, Vals is the only one that can equip it. You've got a desp? Oh, that's awesome! That's awesome, man. I assume that's like a a, a desp, desperate. Oh, that's worth it. Wow. Maybe not. Nah, let's go for it. How about weapons? Do you got any sweet weapons, man? Also, dude, a con? I saw one of those like in like the second town I was ever in. What the hell, man? Item shop? Come on. Big money, big money, no whammies, no whammies. Stop! Potion 3s. M Herb 2. It is about time. Magic water, antidote, wind balls. No jewels, but I don't really care about jewels anyways. I will buy those M Herb 2s off screen. Want some? Talk to you, talk to you. Make fun of my plane. Don't want to talk to you no more. Ooh, a double door house. What is up? Yeah, I'm gonna kick your ass. Okay. Yay! Inside games. Oh, and I notice you have nobody to play with. Oh, that sucks. Remember when I was a kid, I was like, hey, let's play Battleship. And they're like, no. And I'm like, but but then I can't play Battleship. You guys suck. Talk to you. Let's go. Oh, let's just see in. Huge in. Looks like a tavern. Oh, with an upstairs. Sweet. I call Top Bunk. Where the hell are the beds? Y yeah. Could you be a little more specific? No. No, that's the other orange dude with the spikes coming out of his shoulders. Oh, come on. Uh, where are your beds? Do you have beds? See, look, just it's an inn. Still cheap, holy crap, two, 12 gold. 
I, can I afford that? What's what I have minus 12? I didn't even get in a fight anyways. No, don't know how to recover my journey. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the, 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 the inn with no beds. Um, what's up, priestess looking dude? The prophet? Tell the prophet I'm busy! Ah, tell him to talk to the disciple first. What's up? Wait. Dark world again? Gore fun? Okay. I have no idea what's going on. Oh, let's talk to the robot thing here. Um, okay. That, that sucks, actually. So let's go into this, like, freaking huge church. Holy shnikes, this is a church, man. Puts all the other ones to shame. What's up? Yeah, like 20 towns ago. Why? Yes, the prophet wishes to see me. I will talk to him soon enough. Is this the actual house of healing? Quit. I love that, like, yeah. But the house of healing, if you don't want to do anything, they don't say, like, cancel or leave or goodbye. It says quit. I quit this conversation. The prophet is in the back room. I am I allowed on the altar in this church? I got yelled at last time I walked out to the altar. Something, something about desecrating Jesus. It wasn't fun. Okay. D do I want to talk to you now? Let's do it! Yeah? What evil? Who? Gariso! Dude, Lamil is old. Okay. Moonlight. Okay, Moonlight's good. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Wait, no, yes or no? What? That's it? Like... Oh my gosh, you're going to say it all again. Oh my god. Oh, shut up. Wow, you have a great memory of being able to repeat that speech twice. Were you nervous about talking to me about it? So you had to, like, repeat it over and over, practice it in the mirror? And then finally when I showed up, you had it memorized. Whatever. Alright, so I am going to purchase those items I talked about off screen and I will meet you right outside the weapon, the, the item shop, most likely. Be right back. Alright, and I'm back right outside the house of healing really because if you go over here and over here, you should be able to find a, a bottle of ice. I'm pretty sure that was just an open bottle that somebody left on the ground. Because there's ice everywhere. I'm kind of stepping all in it. It's getting all up in my toes. Alright, so this is pretty much going to be the end of this part. It does look like I am running a little bit low on time. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode of Let's Play the Seven Saga. I have been Baller Scuba, joined as always by Necro and his trusty companion, Valso. Valso. Much love to Valso. Alright, and when we come back on the next episode, we'll try to explore this western continent. No thanks to you, you stupid plain you. I hate you. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this part. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.